Okay, so this uh, video was uh, actually a request that I got on how to install a four, five, or six point harness, specifically the shoulder straps. The uh, waist belt kind of just bolts into the the stock positions where uh, your lap belt normally would go. But uh, on this particular application, we have to wrap the shoulder harnesses around a harness bar or a roll cage. So, um, mine came with these on the shoulder straps, which uh, if you have somewhere to bolt it to, then you can use these, but I don't, so I'm, I just took them off. Um, so here is your harness for your shoulders. Uh, just for a visual effect, we're going to just pretend that this is the harness bar. Um, I'm just going to show you real quick how to do it and then we'll go to my car and we'll install it into the car. So basically you're going to start with the strap going underneath the harness bar or your roll cage. And then from there you got uh, your buckle right here. It's going to go up through. Pull it tight and it's going to go back down in to the other side like like so and then you're going to come back around and then go back through the far side and then pull it tight and then the excess can hang over or you can do whatever you want to but that's not going anywhere that's that's how race quip and takata recommend you to wrap around a harness bar or a roll cage i'm sure there's other ways to do it but that's the way that race quip specifically um their instructions show how to do it so now we'll just take it over to my car and we'll install it into the car so okay here we are in my car um so i already have one strap installed so i've got my lap belt in already so we're just going to install the next one we'll go through the seat i don't know if you can see this or not But uh, I'm going to go underneath the bar. Um, it might take some trial and error to adjust the length that you need. But we're going to go underneath the bar. Go back into the front side of your buckle. Pull it tight. back down through the other side. I don't know if you can see this or not. So now it's tight and now it's going to go across and back down into your I don't know if you can see this or not but So this is what it should look like after it is done. And you can see now that my harnesses are a little uneven, so I have to get some slack out. But make sure that you have enough slack right here to buckle in safe, safely as nice and tight on your passenger or yourself if it's on the driver's side so yeah that's it so i have the, the buckle style i wish i had a cam lock but you know live and learn just in case you don't know how to use these you have a, your male side goes through 
these your two shoulders and then underneath and the buckle clips down like that and then you tighten tighten down accordingly it looks comfortable so that's that's how you uh, wrap the harness around your roll cage or your harness bar uh, if you got any questions you know leave them in the comments I'll try to get back to you